as we get closer and closer to this the release of day of the day before and you look more and more into this situation this is just looking bad right so the looking into it you know i made a brief video before talking about what i was thinking what i was hoping from the experience and uh just an overview but as you really dig into what this game has been doing this is just this doesn't seem like march 1st this game is going to be ready uh you look at it here they're having it to where just june of 2022 they were looking for volunteers to help them finish and cre finish creating and, and test the game um as a volunteer program and then they got backlash uh f fantastic got backlash for this and they said oh no we have a two-part system there's paid volunteers and then there's uh there's full-time and there's part-time in which full-time uh are employees do you know if you're paying them and their employees they're no longer volunteers literally if you're volunteering it's meaning you are just doing it free of will for love or for whatever reason you are offering up your service to do that job then you have it to where they're back and forth they don't know if it's going to be a beta they're talking about they may be a beta it depends on their publisher okay as we stand right now this game comes out in two less than two months now because it has a march 1st release when are you going to do a beta you're supposed to get the feedback from the beta and use that to tighten up what needs to be tightened up and now they're talking about that you, you you're seeing gameplay where it some of it looks good some of it looks bad i just have a feeling this is not going it's, it's going to be a dud on release as as i've said and then they're, they're having um, FAQs where people can ask them questions on the Discord. I was trying to get on the Discord. I can't get it. But one of the things that when, when I pulled up was talking, when they were talking to one of the um, designers, is that they're saying how wonderful the game is and how uh, every time they're finding some new discovery in the system and uh operating the system and i'm like you should not be finding new discoveries in your system and what you want to put in the game now this the the faq was in december you should already have your system flushed out now is not the time to be discovering new uh new things from using unreal engine which you just switched to last summer so this game has been in development hell forever and now you'd switch to unreal engine 5 in july and now you're saying in december you're finding brand new discoveries in the system and ways to implement stuff you should be strictly at this point testing marketing getting everybody ready for your game to come out i don't know release a beta at this point not not being amazed that new discoveries in your own system in ways you can implement gameplay that sounds like you're still developing the game in december i don't know and the sad part is they they've had several games that they're linking when they're pushing it on their twitch channels which are their prior games, which have also have been half-baked dud games. I don't know how they can go with this in this state. I would honestly not be surprised if it gets pushed out longer. Hell, it's been pushed back, what, several times now? I mean, um... Yeah, several times now. At least I've been talking about this game for at least three years, right? At the least, I just can't think that far back because I've heard about and seen stuff before the pandemic. Um, I don't know what they're gonna do with this game, right? 
I don't know. For for me to hear the things that are coming from this game, and they're saying that it's supposed to be a dense based population of the game. To me, the game looks empty. To me, from what they've shown, everything is heavily scripted. Everything is um very situational, but it's empty. Uh, it should be a feeling where you know, since everything seems to be in the countryside. Hear what I'm saying here? It should be if you go in the if you go in the cities, it should be like uh the Walking Dead when uh the main character first woke up and went in the city and it was a nightmare in his horse. I haven't seen Walking Dead in years, so please forgive me if I, if I forgot that guy's name. But going into the city should be a journey, should be where, oh, God, we got to go in the city because a city, urban areas are heavily dense populated areas. But whenever I see a lot of the gameplay, it's empty, heavily scripted until they get to whatever event they want to happen. Does everything pop off? Uh, I just I don't know. It's just a lot of emptiness. There is maybe hope. I have another video talking about the hope. I don't want to sit here and bash this game like this, but all roads point to disaster as far as this game is concerned. And as far as what they've done with it so far and everything that just keeps, it's just, it's just rolling out the internal stuff that was going on the whole time this game was being made. But let me know what you think in the comments down below. You still purchasing it? You, you willing to wait? Uh, is it hope? Which we'll speak about the hope and the aspirations of this game in another video. I got one more about that, but this is Revo's.